Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy the Golden Boy and today we are back on Apex Legends and today what I have for you guys is a 20 kill badge with crypto that someone wanted to pay for it on their account. So I ended up getting that 20 kill badge for them. I have not played crypto on my own account. Now, uh, I definitely think I will play crypto on my own account just to get the badge and the 4k and everything like that along with every other legend because i still haven't done that yet on my own account i've gotten every single 4k every single 20 on every single character and everything like that but they're mostly on other people's accounts and stuff but uh, i probably will get it on my account with this uh character but he's not really my play style and if you guys want to wonder like if he's good for ranked or pubs in my opinion uh, i definitely think he's better overall in pubs i think for ranked he's pretty useless and that is because uh there's like two or three reasons main reasons too uh his drone can be shot out of the sky with one bullet his drone affects you and your teammates so if you're trying to do like a push you know where your two uh two teammates are running at someone and you want to push them stun them and then you know take over that would be great but it affects their teammate your teammates and you at the same time which sucks and then thirdly which is the most important if there's a drone in the sky and someone's trying to emp you you know for a fact that the teammates are probably near trying to do a push and that means that there's not going to be a third player in the fight so it's only going to be a 2v3 and in ranked you're not going to want to do that because most likely in ranked you're going to be in pred lobbies and stuff like that if you're really good and you're going to be 2v3 and a 2v3 in pred is not easy at all so it's, you're at a major disadvantage if you do that so that's my opinion on crypto and ranked uh, in public matches i think he's pretty good in pubs uh, if you have a teammate that's not that great or maybe he's more of a passive player i think crypto would be a perfect fit for you you could just sit in the drone and spot out enemies for the person on your team that is way better or maybe way more aggressive and stuff like that so uh, he's definitely a really good player for the uh casual player slash like more passive player um and then nextly I think that uh, I'm going to be coming out with a video here soon of rotations for 20 kill badges because I, f I feel like I've known the map now. The map's been out for about two, two and a half weeks. I've gotten a bunch of wins, gotten like, I don't know, like 15, 20, 20 bombs already and stuff like that. I've got a lot of gameplays coming out for you guys uh, here pretty soon. And I feel like I know the rotations for this map more than likely. Uh, there's some better rotations that you can learn, and there's there's still a lot of randomness to this map. This map is extremely random compared to King's Canyon, but uh, there's definitely a few rotations that I've seen that work pretty uh, pretty like often, to be honest. Like I've been landing certain areas and then rotating in other areas, and I've been getting a lot of kills there like almost every single game. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. Like I said, next video coming out is a rotation for the 20 kill badge. So let me know if you want to see that video. Uh, and I'll make that pretty soon in the next day or two. But hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Recharging my shields. Recharging my shields.
That's one step closer. Nice work, brother. of their squad. It's hard to survive alone. I downed one. Good thing that's done. I've been down. Fighting. Recharging the shields. Incoming grenade. Ten seconds to get back on the grid. Shot that cargo bot. Contact with hostile. Heads up. Only two other squads left. On the creed. Reloaded. I downed one. That's one step closer. Good kill, brother. 